Hi guys, I'm Wani and welcome to Wani's house and welcome to my mess. So I shared with you guys that I have started, um, I really broke down the guest bedroom here. My brother had a lot of boxes and things that he had delivered here and I had pretty much became his drop off point and his, um, his storage facility. So I went through, and I'm going to take you here in a minute, I went through the boxes and collapsed and um, downsized a lot of the boxes and put some things in other boxes and I um, took a lot of things out of the closet that was um, in the closet and to put the boxes. So I'm going to show you the closet that is in here, what I've done and um, the total disarray that this room is in now i was getting ahead of myself because i've already started disassembling the bed so i'm gonna um wash the bed and change the bedding out and um we're gonna try to get this room together so um here are some things here that i have these lamps here were actually can you see them they were the ones that were in my dining room I have the vacuum here because I had to vacuum out the closet. I have some things over here that Mr. B is going to have to take up to the attic for me. So we're going to go and I'm going to share this catastrophe here. So I came in here and realized that I did not have my camera. So I'm beginning to strip off the bed and um, I'm going to wash the linen, the bed linen. And um a coverlet set here's some things over here that I took out the closet I'm going to collapse these pillows some of these pillows I might be getting rid of so we'll see about that here's some other linen and pillows and things that came out of that closet some lampshades and yeah I have some decor up here so I told you guys this is it's ridiculous. This is in another box that came in for my brother. So I'm going to have to put that in here. And this is the closet for in this space. And um, Puda still has stuff in here, which is why it's not totally clear and clean. Because I want her to come through here and see if there's anything that she wants to get rid of. So when she comes home next year she can come through and get whatever and then when she moves into her apartment she can take whatever with her but I need to have this clear so these are all of the boxes that is in here from my brother plus the one that I have out there and so I have you know my um, gift wrap and things right here and it's a suitcase and then my dryer and here's some remnant carpet so it is a it's a um, fairly decent size walk-in closet but when um, I want it to be available for like when Puda comes home for the couple of months that she'll be here until she gets her apartment she needs to be able to use this space so this is gonna have to be gone by then so hopefully he will get here, have gotten his stuff together and come and got and picked up a lot of this stuff and taken it with him on his truck. So, yeah, so this is everything that we have to do here. Told you guys, it's a hot mess. And it is spilled out into my hallway. And so that is driving me crazy. So I am going to try to get as much of this done today but yeah because I, I i can't have this room like this um that much like it, it really make it overwhelms me and um yeah so let's get this going so this might take a couple of days if it does i'm gonna definitely let you guys know how many days it took me but yeah so we're gonna go ahead and get this room started okay so i am actually on my lunch break so I have an hour so I'm gonna see how much I can get done in this hour <sighs> and um, yeah how far I can go and get done and so I'm probably gonna have to do several 
loads of laundry um, for this. So I'm going to have to do one for the white, for the lights, and yeah. So maybe two, two loads of laundry. So let's get it done. I'm gonna set this clean with yeah. me to music and then yeah, towards the end yeah, where yeah. I have decorated the space I, I will come back I've in and let you know where I purchased I everything. Eyes, noticed I'm hella blessed. Staring at you on the set plane. I ain't worried about nothing. Cause you got me feeling like the Wayne White in 03. Yeah, you and me, we got the heat. So bump all the anxiety. But you hit to the side of me. I feel like I'm gliding. And honestly, look, I don't want you saying that you had a better chance without you. That you wish you had made plans without me. Look, I hate to make this song about me. But I really wanna tell you that. Tell me what it ain't Trigger happy, you looking by I might just detonate yeah. Tell them dudes looking far back Kidding and kill, I need all that Let them call, but don't call back Let them call, but don't uh. I don't want you saying that you had a better chance without me That you wish you had made plans without me Look, I hate to make this song about me But I really wanna tell you that All right, so this is my almost completed space. Um, in another video, I'll show, share with you what I've done to the other side of the room. But this is the front of the um, bed and I have this bench here and then I have these pillows with this throw. The pillows, the small pillows were picked up from TJ Maxx last year as well as Joanne's. That pillow in the middle, the white burlap pillow was from Hide and Home and I share a walkthrough with you with them um, last week and if you missed it, I'll put it in the iCard above. This pillow was purchased from TJ Maxx a couple of years ago as well as the pillow behind it. The throw is a throw that I already had and these are pillow covers that I picked up from Amazon. If you're interested in them, I will have them in my Amazon store, but I love them because it's sort of like a cable knit sweater, perfect for the upcoming um, seasons. Really nice, innocent white. So this um, bed spread here is actually from Ross. It's a coverlet set and I loved it because I love the sparkles at the bottom. The, the sequence at the bottom, that detail is absolutely beautiful and it's what in instantly attracted me to this bed spread. Now I have my tray in the middle of the bed with those thrifted candlesticks and the glass jars came from the Dollar Tree and this um, pearlized pumpkin was from TJ Maxx a couple of years ago.
Now that arrangement is simply some Dollar Tree florals that I um, picked up in that beautiful warm um, beige color and the candles that are in those vases they were from the Dollar Tree as well guys. Now, and I decided to use these pillows here. I already had them, had them for a couple of years now. Gave them a fresh wash and they are perfect. I love how it's white and then that really nice slate color with the silver slate sequence detail. I think it's so romantic and elegant. Now on my guest side table, um, the side table came from Ikea. I just have the candle there that is from Aldi's and some floral picks. And this is an overview of the space. I absolutely loved it. I'm waiting for a couple of more things to come back in, come in, and then you will see the other side of this room. But for now, it is almost together. So guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. If you're new to Wani's house, I would love for you to subscribe. So go ahead, hit that subscribe button as well as that notification bell so that you won't miss out on any of my upcoming uploads also guys come on over and check me out on my instagram you can find me over there at wani's house just like it is here hit that follow button and then you will be in the know as to what is to come over here at wani's house so guys i'm about to go but before i do you know what i always say the next time you're in town you can always stop by wani's house and i'll see you in the next video good night